in the mighty name of Jesus. message find you welcome to another Ernest West Ministries and I just wanted to give a quick report but also a word a report as well as a, a word and, and, and the, the report is that everyone is feeling better uh, my daughters uh, they're feeling better they were sick they're feeling better the wife she's on the men's I'm on the men's all of us on the men's um, but this is what I was going to say in scripture, Jesus said, Come unto me, all you that weary and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn of me, for my yoke is easy and my burdens are light. And so, I want to give an example um, of what God spoke to my spirit concerning those who are listening to me. The other day, I think it was yesterday. Yesterday, uh, my daughter was sick, uh, Abby, and she wasn't feeling good the night before. She didn't rest much, and so uh, I had to go to work. And so, but on my way to work, my prayer was, God, let her rest. Let her rest because I knew that if she would rest, then the healing would begin to uh, become greater. She would feel better. And so she did. She rested. And, and that is the word that God has spoke to my spirit this morning, this day, and said that many of you who have been running your mind and spinning, you've been trying to figure stuff out. you got things, so many things you got to do. And you got to do this, you got to do that. you got to have this. you got to receive this. Uh, and you're just concerned about tomorrow. And God spoke to me to let you know, just rest. Just rest. Because if you rest, rest in him, then he's going to fix it. He's going to cause things to come into line. He's going to cause things to work itself out. And see, the reason why things hasn't, hadn't worked itself out in your particular relationship, your particular life, it is because you're trying to do it. You're trying to do too much. You're trying to fix too much. Some stuff you must sit back and allow God to heal. Allow God to work on this situation and let him work on that situation rest so also in that rest is close your mouth just keep it to yourself keep it to yourself the scripture says God said when you pray go in your closet and shut the door and what you do in secret God is going to reward you openly for it there's a open blessing that God will reward you for for your secret faithfulness there's a open blessing that God wants to give to you, the believer, from your secret faithfulness, your relationship. And, and that is when you obey God. Obedience is better than sacrifice. And so in other words, there's some stuff you don't do nothing. God don't need you. You don't need to fix this, you don't need to fix that. Just, just sit there and allow God to fix you. Say, God, fix me. Not that situation. Not that situation. But me. God, I need your help. And so, your answer is rest. Rest your mind. Rest your thoughts. Uh, uh, rest your conversations. The answer is rest. Complete rest. Is that all right? God bless you. Thank <laughs> you.